everyone welcome back to GK today i am mujhe sana and in this video we'll cover the current affairs before we move ahead let me inform you that these questions are part of our daily 20 mcq series 2022 in the gk today's android application so if you are looking for the text version of these questions and their explanations along with the interactive quiz you may consider joining our daily 20 mcq series in the gk today android application in this course in app you get daily 20 mcqs a fortnightly quiz a monthly revision document and also category wise revision ebooks that are optimized for reading on mobile you are also able to access all archives of questions from january 2020 onwards and let me tell you one more thing if you want the hindi version of this session you can refer to our former channel named as gk today the link has been given in the description box from where you can reach to so without taking much of your time let's get started good morning everyone welcome back to gk today and today we'll be discussing most important mcqs for 20th of august 2022 let's start what is the name of the national campaign launched to focus on the development of children in the first 2 years so union health ministry has launched a new campaign named as palan 1000 national campaign and a parenting application so it focuses on the development of children in the first 2 years and this application was launched at the early childhood development conclave so basically it will provide the caregivers with practical advice on the things to do in their everyday routine and also it will help to solve the doubts of parents fine so the name of this national campaign is palan 1000 next is which state or the union territory launched the first flight of the drone service medicine from the sky so arunachal pradesh has successfully launched the first flight of the drone service medicines from the sky from sepa to kayang tajo okay so the government of arunachal pradesh has decided to conduct a pilot project of using the drones in the healthcare agriculture and disaster management in association with world economic forum okay you have to tell me where does the headquarters of world economic forum lie next is which city hosted the conference on international security 2022 so russia has hosted the moscow conference on international security 2022 and the russian president vladimir putin addressed the participants virtually so from india side our defense minister rajnath singh took part in this conference virtually and expressed the concerns about the potential geopolitical fault line in the maritime domain okay so this conference was attended by ministers of defense from different countries as well as key stakeholders in the military field okay so conference on international security is hosted by moscow next is which country passed the inflation reduction act 2020 So the US government has recently passed Inflation Reduction Act 2022 and with this it has joined the forces with its central bank in the fight to reduce the inflation. So US Federal Reserve has increased the policy rates by an unprecedented 225 basis points over the last four monetary policy meeting and uh, this act aims to boost the government revenue by 700 37 billion dollars and is spent around 437 billion dollars during 2022 to 31 okay so this saving is expected to translate into lower deficit later on fine so this act is related to usa usa was also in news in the starting of this year because of its competitive act if you remember right and uh, you have to tell me what is the full form of this acronym competes next is the cabinet approved additional amount of 50000 crore rupees in ecl gs scheme and it is earmarked for which sector so the union cabinet has approved the enhancement in the limit of ecl gs scheme from 4.5 lakh crore rupees to now 5 lakh crore rupees and the additional amount of this 50000 crore rupees is earmarked 
only for enterprises in hospitality and related sectors and validity of this scheme is 31st of march 2023 right what is this eclgs emergency credit line guarantee scheme okay next is what is the growth forecast of international monetary fund for india in 2022 to 23 as per its recent update so imf has lowered india's gdp projection from 8.2 percent to now 7.4 percent in its world economic outlook update july 2022 report and reasons are vulnerability of the indian economy to external shocks and rapid monetary policy tightening and in the month of april imf slashed the growth forecast of india from 9 percent that was estimated in the month of january to 8.2 percent fine and this 8.2 percent has further been lowered to now 7.4 percent answer would be option number b next is which state or the union territory is developing a dedicated e-commerce application for the local artisan so an e-commerce platform is being developed to connect the buyers directly with the local artisans in jammu and kashmir and this will help to uplift the artisan community and promote the handicraft there in jammu and kashmir so that's why a memorandum of understanding has been signed with flipkart to help the local artisans to sell their product fine so jammu and kashmir is developing a dedicated application for the local artisan next is which state approved the defense and aerospace unit and employment promotion policy 2022 so uttar pradesh government has approved the uttar pradesh defense and aerospace unit and employment promotion policy 2022 and this new policy will aim at providing higher incentive to the investors who are setting up their units in the defense and in aerospace manufacturing sector in the uttar pradesh defense industrial corridor okay so this new policy provides for a capital subsidy of 7% or 10% or it can go to a maximum of 500 crore rupees as well fine so this is the policy of uttar pradesh government next is which is the venue of the international conference on responsible packaging so international conference on responsible packaging is set to be held in new delhi and it is organized by foundation for innovative packaging and sustainability and this event focuses on optimal design innovative material and sustainable technology so that's why an award for responsible packaging known as foundation for innovative packaging and sustainability award will also be launched during this conference fine so venue of this conference is new delhi next is mission swavalamban is a flagship initiative of which particular institution so this is the initiative of sibbi full form is small industries development bank of india headquarters lies in lucknow so sibbi has launched the fifth phase of setting up of 300 swavalamban silai schools across 10 districts of six states okay and this was launched under its flagship initiative mission swavalamban so it will cover which states for example chatisgarh haryana goa puducherry jammu and kashmir and ladakh okay and aim is to empower the women making them independent while pursuing entrepreneurship culture that is udyam se azadi fine so this is the initiative of sibbi next is which institution launched its hackathon named as bima manthan 2022 this is irdai full form is insurance regulatory and development authority of india it has invited the individuals and institutions to develop technology driven innovative solutions for automated death claim settlement curtail miss selling and other fields related to 
insurance. So this was launched as a part of its first hackathon named as Bhima Manthan 2022 and theme was innovation in insurance. Okay. Next is who has been appointed as the managing director of National Bank for Financing Infrastructure and Development. So Raj Kiran Rai G has been appointed as the MD of this particular institution for the next five years. Actually, in the year 2021, the government of India had appointed K. V. Kamath as the chairperson of the Development Finance Institution. And the government has infused 20,000 crore rupees into this National Bank for Financing Infrastructure and the Development to start its operations to mobilize the investment in infrastructure sector. Fine. So the MD of this institution is Rajkiran Rai G. So these were the most important current affairs and the news from today. And now we'll move on to our revision section. Today we'll be covering which three categories. First of all, we'll see some of the important rankings after which we'll see important host and after that we'll come to important cities okay so first of all we'll see important rank and indices what is the consumer price index based inflation recorded in july 2022 so cpi based inflation in july 2022 is 6.71% okay and this value was 7.01% in the month of june 2022 and this data is released by National Statistics Office, right? So this was all about consumer price index and India's wholesale inflation in the month of July has come to 13.93% from 15.18% in the month of June. So with this, vegetables, milk and fuel have become cheaper. However, the inflation remained in the double digit for the 16 month okay and it is contributed by rise in the prices of mineral oil food articles crude petroleum natural gas and uh, basic metal electricity chemical and chemical product food product etc okay so only thing you have to remember is for july month cpi based inflation is 6.7 percent and for the same month wholesale inflation is 13.93 percent which university has been ranked first in the Nature Index 2022 ranking? So this ranking has been topped by University of Hyderabad. As for the Bloomberg Billionaires Index, who is the richest woman in Asia? Richest woman in Asia is Savitri Jindal, who is the chairperson of OP Jindal Group. Okay. Also, don't forget that she has replaced Yang who Yan, who is from China and Savitri Jindal is the 10th richest person in India. Which state is ranked first in the Niti Aayog's India Innovation Index 2021? This is the state Karnataka. Second was Telangana. Third was Haryana and fourth was Maharashtra. Fine. And uh, don't forget that if we talk about Northeastern and Hilly categories, then the first state among them is Manipur and uh, talking about the Union Territory, Chandigarh was at the top. Okay. What was India's position in the Institute for Management Development's Annual World Competitiveness Index 2022? So in this India was ranked at 37th and the first country in this index was Denmark, second was Switzerland and third was Singapore. Okay, who is the richest man in Asia according to the most recent Bloomberg Billionaires Index? So according to the most recent Bloomberg Billionaire Index, richest man in Asia is Mukesh Ambani and he has replaced Gautam Adani. Okay, who is the first person in this ranking? It is Elon Musk and second was Jeff Bezos. Fine. Now we will see few important hosts that were in news. Which country hosted the Super Garud Shield Defense Exercise? So this exercise was hosted by the country Indonesia at their Sumatra Island. And which countries participated in this shield defense exercise? US, 
इंडोनेशिया ऑब्वियसली ऑस्ट्रेलिया जापान एंड सिंगापुर एंड फ्यू कंट्रीज वर प्रेजेंट देयर एज द ऑब्जर्वर एज वेल विच कंट्री होस्टेड द बायोलिट्रल एयर एक्सरसाइज नेम्ड एज उदार शक्ति उदार शक्ति इज द बायोलिट्रल एयर एक्सरसाइज बिटवीन इंडिया एंड मलेशिया एंड दिस टाइम दिस एक्सरसाइज वॉज होस्टेड बाय मलेशिया इट सेल्फ विच स्टेट और द यूनियन टेरिटरी होस्ट द फर्स्ट खेलो इंडिया वुमेन्स हॉकी लीग अंडर सिक्सटीन सो इट हैज बीन स्टार्टेड ऑन सिक्सटीन ऑफ ऑगस्ट रिसेंटली एट मेजर ध्यान चंद स्टेडियम इन न्यू डेली सो आंसर विड बी न्यू डेली विच सिटी वॉज द होस्ट ऑफ द फर्स्ट ऑल इंडिया डिस्ट्रिक्ट लीगल सर्विसेज अथॉरिटीज मीट आंसर विड बी न्यू डेली एंड प्राइम मिनिस्टर नरेंद्र मोदी हैज एड्रेस्ड दिस पर्टिकुलर मीटिंग एंड इट वॉज ऑर्गेनाइज बाय नेशनल लीगल सर्विसेज अथॉरिटी दैट इज नालसा द ट्वेंटी ट्वेंटी टू एशिया कप विल बी प्लेड इन विच कंट्री विच श्रीलंका एज द ऑफिशियल होस्ट दिस एशिया कप वुड बी प्लेड इन द कंट्री यू ए एंड यू ए विल होस्ट दिस पर्टिकुलर कप फॉर द सेकेंड कॉन्जिक्यूटिव टर्म बिरमिंगम विच होस्ट द ट्वेंटी सेकेंड कॉमनवेल्थ गेम्स इज अ सिटी ऑफ विच कंट्री इट लाइज इन यू के विच स्टेट होस्टेड द फिडे चेस ओलम्पियाड फॉर द फर्स्ट टाइम इन इंडिया आंसर वुड बी तमिलनाडु and this is the very first time that india has hosted this event and uh, tamil nadu hosted this fide chess olympiad at its mahabalipuram near chennai okay and this event was inaugurated by our prime minister narendra modi in presence of tamil nadu chief minister who is that mk stalin fine now let's see some of the important cities that were in news Which city is the host of conference on the cotton challenges ahead 2022? Answer would be Coimbatore. Which is the first Indian city to publish the transportation emission data in collaboration with Google? So this feature is actually available only for five cities in India, which are these: Chandigarh, Aurangabad, Bangalore, Chennai, and Pune. And under it. the cities can measure the carbon emission source conduct various type of analysis and identify measures or structures so as to reduce the emission fine so the first indian city to make the transportation emission data public is aurangabad okay which foreign banks ifsc banking unit was recently inaugurated in the gift city ahmedabad so recently the ifsc banking unit of desha bank has been inaugurated in ahmedabad and cb national conference on the drug trafficking and the national security was held in which city it was held in chandigarh which state launched its semiconductor policy 2022 to 27 and plan to develop a semicon city answer would be gujarat which city hosted incredible india kargil marathon and the tourism festival 2022 this is kargil which is the host city of international conference on chemistry and applications of soft material this is thiruvananthapuram okay now let's start with today's quiz here on the slide you can see five questions which have been taken from the past 2 3 days current affairs pause the video and try to solve each of these questions and at the end of the lecture do not forget to share your scores in the comment section so please be honest and do not cheat with yourself so that's it for today i hope you have liked the session these were the important news and events from today and we will meet again tomorrow with some more important current affairs till then stay tuned thank you so much for watching and please do not forget to subscribe to gk today with this meenu sarsana signing off